Hi guys and welcome to a new game. Um, this has only been sent to me about ooh, a few hours ago, to be honest with you. Um, downloaded it quickly this morning and have a quick look. Um, this is Lou, Lou Publishers of Doomstar. A little bit different to what I normally play. It is a strategic game, which I do play, but it's a board game. Very similar to a game that I used to play as a child called Stratego, which is why I wanted to show you it. Gonna play, we're going to go through the campaign. I'm going to start off on this guy. Now, I have done these, but I'm going to do them again just for you guys. I'm going to go through. Basically, you can read all of this if you like. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, yeah, so the objective is to destroy your opponent's command ship, basically. This is the important bit. This is the only unit with a strength of one, and if destroyed, you lose the game. So that means you have to destroy the opponent's one, but you have to protect yours at the same time. Ships move one square per turn and can't move diagonally. To move a ship, it kind of moves one square a turn. Depends on the ship. We're going to go straight into it. Right, we've got these. I'm going to randomise placement. You've got to protect this guy down here. These are the guys. This is, I think, their, their strength. So this is going to be a small one. We need to find... I'm going to bring him back straight away. I want to get him. Now, we know that he's not going to be attacking with that piece, so we know it's going to be one of these guys. So again, I'm going to move him back. And we're going to go... We're going to take him forward. He's only going to move one ship. It's going to be annoying. We're going to attack. Here we go. We found him straight away. We win. We've won that game. Excellent. That's the objective. That's what you've got to win. We're going to go back to this mission. Thank you. We're going to go on a mission two now. Play scenario. Begin. Randomise our placement. Uh, can we... Can we use that one? Because at least he's a bit more protected. Here we go. We've got to find their thing. So we're going to go... I'm just going to attack straight away. Is this going to be... I can move another fighter group. But he's then going to know... Hmm, no, I don't want to do it. I know they can beat those. Certain things will destroy certain things. And we know that's got a strength of four. So we know where he is. This got strength of two. Um, I kind of want to push into the back more. Um, let's take these guys up. We now know, because he's moved three things, that's a fighter. So it's one of these, so a two and a two. We also know that's a fighter, so that's a two and a two. So I'm going to move that across. Now he's no, he's going to know that's a fighter, but he's not going to know which type of fighter. I reckon it's this guy back here, or this guy. I reckon he's going to protect him. So I'm going to move him out so that I can go up the back and flank. Let's see what he does. No, so it's not him, interestingly. So we don't know who what these two are. Let's go across for this guy. If he attacks me, he attacks me. He's going to bring this guy in. Waiting for your opponent. He's going to try for him. He's going to lose. What to do? Run away, basically. Because if you put two fighters in, it's only going to equal the amount of points, if you see what I mean. So, he would have lost. So we're going to go for this guy, because I think that's his command ship. And it is. That's what he's got to work out, basically, where those guys are. There we go, we've done that. So we're going to go back to this mission three now. We're going to play through the scenario as we go. Here we go, randomised. Now these are interesting. Uh, we're going to start game. He's very well protected back here. Um, I'm only going to move one square just to see what he does. I'm going to put him up back. Now, I reckon it could be him. I don't know. Alright, that's a six. Now, um, put him there. I can move this guy. We're going to attack as well. Oh, So if that's, that's a fire, bad move, mate. Bad move. He's going to bring another fire. He's going to lose. We're going to bring him up to there and take on that fighter group. Got to 
remember, we're trying to protect and attack at the same time. And take him on. He should have two of these big six. We found him! There we go. We won. We won number four. So let's go down that mission four. Here we go. Bigger grid. More ships. Randomise our placement. I don't want to do that one. No. No. I want... Let me put these guys back a minute. I want to put... There's no way I want to... I've got two lots of mines, you see, so what I want to do... Put those there. That there. Where's my command ship? I want to put him in so he's well protected. But I also want a good set of craft that can go forward. Can I put them there? No, because that will move the mines. I've got a couple of these that can go in at the back. Let's do it like that. There we go. It's going to be an interesting one. Right, let's move. He knows they're fighters now, you see. We've got to test our theory. It's a minefield! No, we know where the mines are. They stay there, by the way. Ooh, nasty. This is nasty. Let's move in with our fighters. He's probably put it on another minefield. Right, we know where both his minefields are. Bring this guy in. Yeah, yeah, we got it. I've just realised it's going to be awkward for me to get that guy out. I'm going to push up. Oh, hefty one. Yeah. I should have moved this guy out because he, he was going to know he was there anyway. Um, this is going to be an issue. I don't want him there, actually. No. I don't think I can go for my own mines. I might lose this game. Yeah, I, I kind of put him in the wrong place. Can I? Yeah, the victory will be his. Unfortunately, we need to push through with this fighter. And we're going to lose the fighter. And we're going to lose this guy, which means I've only got this guy left. So it is going to be a restart. Because we've only got this guy left. He kind of knows which ship is, is my last one. So basically, I'm now looking for anything that's going to move. Or doesn't move. Right, now I know it's not then. And the thing is, we know he's a fighter. He can catch me. Which means he's going to get me this turn, and there's nothing I can do about it. Oh, no, he didn't. Right. I'm wondering if it's one of these guys. He's only moving one, which is interesting. We've got to attack with this. It's, it could be any of those four ships. We're going to go for it. We could lose here. Minefield. Three mines. How did he get three mines? He defeated me, so we're going to play again. We're going to randomise our placement this time. I'm definitely not doing that. And I'm definitely not doing that. All right. Um. Because that just ties us in. We'll swap those. We'll swap those. We'll swap those. We'll put those up there. No, they can move. That's better. And we'll put them there and we'll bring him in here. Did I put them all in? Because I only had one of those last time. Right. We can go forward with a heavy hitter. Yes. Oh, excellent. He's lost one of his heavy hitters. That's good. He's not going to know. Bang, he's lost both his heavy hitters. This is what we want. I don't know if we're going to play this for an hour. Probably going to, only going to be a half an hour session today. Um, 
move this guy up to there. All right, we know that's probably going to be a fighter because he's moved two. That's minefield. Oh, he went above the minefield. Go. How does that work? I forgot about minefields. Uh, let's go there. We go up there. We've got to find this guy. He knows he's a fighter. We can move another fighter up. We're only going to move him one square. He knows he's a fighter now. So let's start working through the back line. Ooh. We can bring him up. I don't know what he's doing with him. He's a bit... There we go, we found him. We won. There we go. So, we're at mission one. Now, I've not done this one yet. So this is as far as I've got. So we're now in new territory. Randomise the spawn point. I really don't want him there. We'll put him in the back there. Uh, bring those up. Mines are okay towards the front. As long as the ships have got a way to get out. We've got no sixes. Okay, so let's go for that. I'm going to go there. Not show him my move. Otherwise, he's going to know what's fighters and what's not. Here we go. Oh, what's that? An N. What's an N? I don't know what an N is. I'm still learning the pieces because I haven't been this far. Uh, okay, he can go there. Oh, that's going to be a fighter. Bye bye! He knows where one of our minefields are. I don't know where any of his are, though. I'm going to try and flank him. Oh, so those are two fighters. So I reckon one of my threes can probably take those on. Oh, can I bring in uh, another fighter group? I can, but I can't reach him. Yeah, we can't move those. Um... Let's do that. I don't know what that is. Oh. And the fighter can take out an in apparently. There we go. We know he's a fighter. So we can bring him across. Yeah, you run. We're controlling the board. Oh, we could have moved him again. No one. You're really not. Gonna <laughs> Just take him to there for now. The good thing is, is he, we know he's moving now, so we can bring him up. Have a look. No, you, I think I should. Oh, that wasn't good. Let's take him to the back. We don't know where any of his mines are yet. Okay, that's an equal one. Let's go to that guy there. Try him. There we go, we found him! We've won! Woohoo! Yes! I don't need to move anywhere else. We'll go there just as well. See what that was. That was a mine. Should win. This is a great little board game. This reminds me perfectly of Stratego. Uh, so we've done mission one. We've got to do mission two. Ba -da -ba -ba. Seems like we've got more problems. Another Engarg fleet has been launched and is now targeting our newest settlement. The fleet carries several doom stars with enough firepower to blow up entire planets we don't want that looks like it might not be possible to avoid war intercept the well intercepted here we go Ooh, power unit in the game of seven the doom star disposal as well as ne negaspheres and you have to find a way to his right okay we can do this we don't have a Ship of seven. Um, I'll swap you two over for a start. And I'll bring you there. And you there. 
and I kind of want to swap one of you guys over there. There we go. We're going to go for that movement there. So we're going to move up. And we're not going to move the second unit, although we can. I don't want to reveal to the enemy that that's a fighter unit. We're pretending. There we go. We've got somebody moving. That's interesting. Uh, okay, I'm going to move him up to support. Yeah, goodbye. He knows there's a minefield there now. So I'm going to go in there and attack. Oh, we found him straight away. Oh dear. I wasn't expecting it to go that quick. Yes, we're going to go for this one. Mission 1. Play scenario. In this mission, you are severely outnumbered in terms of firepower, but the fleet comprising mainly fighters, you will have the upper hand in terms of speed and agility ahead on approach won't serve you that well in a mission either but you can find a way around your opponent's front line should give you a good chance of locating their command ship um okay so i really kind of want to bring in lots of fighters um ba -da -ba 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 -bum. like that This is going to be an awkward one. Ow! I've got nothing to defend that. He knows that's a fighter. Oh dear, I've lost, I've lost the fighter. Brute strength is not good. He is going to demolish me on this. Hey, we found him, we won! That was, that was more of a fluke than skill. That was a fluke more than skill. Let's go to mission two. Ba -da -ba -ba. Here we go. Once again, your fleet outnumbered in terms of strength, but if you use your fighters wisely, you should be able to double up on your opponents and win battles. Uh, when setting up your fleet, try and position your fighters so they can utilize black holes. You see, I don't know quite how I do it in order to always attack with more than one ship and send your captain packing for sure. Right. Um, where's our captain? Right, well, I really don't want him there. Out of date. He's going to know I've got a lot of ships in terms of fighters, so we're going to bring the fighters up. We know, we're going to know that guy's a fighter. I'm going to attack him. Can we not go there? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, like that, because a two and a two isn't going to equal that anyway. And we go straight into a minefield, but he's gone past. Okay. So we're two units down, not good. Can I get a fighter to back this guy up? Okay, he's got to be a fighter. Oh, he's a fighter! And he wouldn't give me back up. Um, can I do that? No. Why can't I like We're going bad here. Oops. Oh, he's not gonna let me do him either. That's annoying. I can move another fighter, so I can I not move him? I think we're gonna lose here, big time. He's Let's see if I can move both of these in to take that guy on. But I think I'm only going to equal him, which means I lose both, which is not good. And he wins, so we're going to have to play that one again. That's how you lose the game. That's our first loss. That's not bad. Play a game. Let's randomise. 
Uh, we'll put this guy. I'm going to put him down there. And he's going to come in with his fives first, isn't he? So let's bring all our threes up to the front. And we'll go like that. And I want to try... How do we... I don't know how you use the black holes. So that's a five. So I want to bring this guy here. Done. Yeah. I swear that's a five. All right, okay. Oh, hang on. There and then. No, can I go there? Don't know if it'll let me do that one. Mm. We should be able to go like that. Should give us another fire to move, which will get rid of one of them. We've left our flank a bit <laughs> open here, which I'm hoping to hear think he's down there. That could be another five again by the looks of it. Uh, I'm going to move him up one. And him up one. Yeah, he knows where my fives are. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go for it. He's got a real superior. Oh, he's got a six as well. We're gonna have to trade paint to get rid of him. He is going to annihilate my friends. There's nothing I can do because I need to get right in the back. He's probably got him up here, I reckon. I reckon he's got a mine there. Oh, we found him. He put him on the front line. How amazing is that? We beat him. I'm amazed. So why is that one locked then? Oh, we got this guy now. So we've done one and two. We got this guy. That's okay. He's back apparently. So same 19 years on the standard board featuring black holes. All right. This is this is what you would get in a multiplayer event. These are all your players, and you're fighting against the enemy. So first off, I'm going to put him back there. I'm going to put minefields both sides and I'm going to leave a six there. I'm going to bring a six to there. I'm going to bring the fighters forward. I'm going to bring him forward as well. Put him there. Kind of don't want stuff behind the black holes, really. We're going to go for that. And I'm going to move a hefty old ship up first, see what he does. Right, he's brought a fighter in. So that's either a three or a two, so we know we can take him out, especially Elf. How did he move that many spaces? Hacks. Yeah, you bring your fives in. Yeah, we're going to wipe those two you. So you got to play... Strategic. Why has he gone for him? He's brought another fighter down all the way down from there. Wow. How does he get that many moves? <laughs> right, it's an interesting tactic. But it ain't going to work with me because we got bigger ships. Yeah, I haven't revealed my sixes yet. So he's going to bring another three down. But, oh yeah. He's going to bring another two down. Okay, so I'm going to go like that straight away. Let's force his hand a bit. Ooh, we're going to like for like. Can I get... Why won't that let me... Right, I should be able to do that. I should have one more move, surely. How does he get like 20 different directions and I can only do one? Hmm... 
Let's move these up a bit. I don't want to reveal my fighters, you see. I was trying not to reveal my fighters, he's going to have a two. Whichever way... Mm. Let's do it. He knows where one of my sixes is now. Oop. Fine, well, I'll get rid of your other fighter. Definitely. Take him out of the box. And when I used to play Stratego with my friends, we used to move a lot more pieces before we get into the actual fighting. Uh, so we go at him. That should allow. Ah, oh, it's a minefield. We're going to jump past and we're going to go equal, but I should be able to go to there. Attack. What's going to happen? Is that going to put one of these ships back there and blow up? No, it's going to put him there. Good. Okay, we can go there. Oh, it's a five. I can move another ship across to here, though. save that one but at least we know where he is are oh, you going with this guy along the back I didn't know that it's a four can I know Can't move those, can only move fighters. So we'll move him over to there then. We know he's a fighter, but I can then attack him. So we know where his four and five are. It's gotta be one of these two, I reckon. Do you, what do you think he's a five or? Black holes just give you an extra move around them. He's probably thinking I'm down here, maybe. Now, interestingly, can I go like that and then bring this in as a five? Oh, it's a six! Oh, it's a six! I'll have to take a hit on the three. He's going to come after my six. We're going to go there. He doesn't know what this ship is yet. Let's take him out. Good battle. This is a good battle. He's going to take him out like for like. That's fair enough. That's fair enough. We'll take this guy up. He's going to have a go. You ain't going to win, mate. You ain't going to win. We're going to win this. He's got to be one of these three. He's going to have two mines here. Yeah, look, he wants to attack this guy. He wants to defend. Actually, I know he's a fighter. Let's do. Let's take the fighter out. You can't win, mate. I can't, can I do that? Yes, we can do that. Oh, will that take it out? Yes! Oh, yes, we've taken his six out. Now, right, he's moving. I'm guessing that's him. We'll bring our fighter groups up. We'll bring him across. He knows where my two fighters are. He knows where my six is. He 
kind of going to guess where my thing is, but I'm going to go for this. This should be him. There he is. I knew he was there. There we go. We beat him. We beat him. We're going to carry on. Let's see if we can complete all the missions of the campaign in one go, in one half an hour. Let's randomise off. Wow, what a fleet. All right, where's my command ship? There he is, back there. All right, okay. So I'm going to bring mines in and around him so he can't move. Where's my neutron thing? I'm going to put him over here. Uh, we want fighters double stacked. Like that. Him, I don't really want him there. I'm going to do him like that. We're going to have to put him... Oh, I've got too much. Wow, I've got a seven! That's good. I'm going to put that there. I'm going to put him... There. I'm going to go like that. I'm going to go. This is going to be a massive battle. Okay, right. So, I'm going to go up with one. Plain strategic. Right, we know he's a fighter straight away. Try it, mate. You're dead. Got no chance. Unless you bring another three down, and then I'm dead. Right. Like for like. That's okay. We can do that. Oh, this sucker. Should have added more in the centre, really, actually. Saying that. We're not going to let him know where our fighters are. Okay, he's bringing more down. He's probably a free. Yeah, he's going to go like for like. I don't mind that. I don't mind losing the fives if he's losing two of his units. Although that leaves him with more fives. Saying that, but we've got some sixes and some stuff around. He is pushing up this side, so I'm wondering if he's over this side. One of these maybe. Where's his most protected asset? This is the thing. Well, it ain't going to be that one then, is it? There we go, we've got another fighter. Two for a two. He's going to bring another one in. Silly boy. Or is he? I'm going to go for it. I'm going to bring in one of our larger ships. He's going to bring in a, another fighter. We found one of his mines, look. That's handy to know. So that's a fight. Uh, take that guy. Let's do it. I didn't really need to do that, but I've brought select to fire to retreat from bow. Uh, this one. I want the three in the front. He's going to bring another fighter group down. You know he is. I don't know how he's doing that many moves because that's kind of cheating. Unless he's doing it. On the I haven't worked how to do that yet. So he's retreated his three. I can still do a double fighter move on him to take one unit out. There we go. It's going to bring another fighter in. Here we go. There we go. Fighter. Right, I want to move up. Yeah, we've got to take him out. Okay, I kind of want to protect more here as well, but um, oh, we still haven't got a clue where he is. What we got here? That's a minefield. Go there, out of the way. He's going to take me on with a free. Uh, OK. 
Okay, let's see if we can start pushing in a bit. Minefield. It's going to take on a neutron. Um, we can't really do anything. Oh, it actually took it out. Certain units take out other units. It's quite complicated. Ooh. That could be annoying. I think he's worked out where I am. I think he's over this side. We can take his six out, definitely. Uh, I'm going to bring this guy over here and then up to there. Five for a five. We'll have to do it. He was doing it earlier. It's got to be a tactic. Sure if that shut. I think this is the only unit that's shut. Put him there, way. He's gonna then think. He's a. Yeah, bring it. <laughs> Start pushing through with a heavy unit. Yeah, you can do that. Side. Right, okay, so we know that is a possible free, I would say. Can we not move? Okay. I'll take this fire out because then we should be able to bring him in. Like that. Outmatch him, outclass him. I think the crux of this game is playing it with real people. I don't know where his seven is, but we're going to take it. If it moves, we can kill it. Oh, he's going to take a six for a six. I'm wondering if he's in this corner then, because like we're running out of people to move. We're just going to do some gambling attacks. Um, I don't think I can. No. Um, he knows he's a fighter. I'm going to put him there. Right, we know where his fight is. Oh dear. Now, there's no way he can move that. How? How? I can't move that far, so how can he? I don't know how he's doing that. What do we get with this fleet button? And hidden. Okay, that just gives us an overview. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, he's put him there. Can I bring him there? That was, a, that was a fight for a fight. How? Let's see how can I? How can he do those moves like that? He knows I've got a fight at there. He just don't know how strong he is. Bad luck. Oh, even more bad luck. <laughs> oh, 
already shot it. Never mind. We've got him. Let's take this guy out of the back. <laughs> running out of moves. We're running out of moves, guys. All right, we know he's a fighter. He can die then. I think he's wiped out probably where I'm defending. We've got to go for it. I don't think he's got anything as big as me. Oh, he might have. He knows where the seven is now. I bet it's there. No, that's a fighter. Okay. It's got. To, it's got to be him or him. What's it gonna be? Bring it, mate. Bring it. Oh, I could have put him up there. Let's not. Let's def move him there. We we'll take the fighter up. Try it. If it, yes, got him. That was a good game. I enjoyed that one. I enjoyed that one. You probably are all bored by now, but we're on mission three, the last final scenario. Let's do it. This mission is for the hardcore Doomstar players that want a proper challenge and pits your smaller standard fleet against an overwhelming opponent, utilizing the full fleet. Oh dear, I'm I'm gonna die. The key to victory is not to waste any units in vain and instead try to outmaneuver your opponent and reach his back lines without too many battles. Always make sure you can save some fighters for the end game to be able to move quickly and strike behind the line. There we go. So randomize. I've got a big fleet. Come on. We've got to, we need to save fighters apparently. Um, where's first off this guy? No chance of my putting him there. We're going to put him there. We're going to bring in our mind defences around him again. I think that's a, that's a good thing. Uh, I'm going to bring in a three there. I'm going to put the two there. So no, hang on. I'm going to three, a two, and a two. I'm going to bring in some fives here up front. Bring in the sixes. Four and a six. Do a three a three, two two, uh, five. I want this guy around him. Bring him in. I want quite good lines straight up through, you see, if I can. The least ships behind these, the better. Um I'm going like that. We're going to go, right, this is it. I'm going to move a six first. He's not going to consider that, I don't think. Right, we know where one of his fighters are. Bring it, mate, bring it. Yeah, you want to, you can't possibly be thinking of taking it. Right. You're going to die straight away. And we need to push heavy because he knows where. Oh. We know where his fighters are. We know that's a fighter. We can take those out. If we can take his fighters out, we will. It. We want more more pieces on the board. So he can't now come down through here really because we've got a good attack plan. Right, he moved twice, but that's probably because of that. Let's bring him over. So let's test him out. He's gonna be over this side, isn't he? Oh, like for like. Yeah, yeah, you planned for that to hang up on Donald. Um, right, we know he's a fighter. 
So we'll look what he is. There we go, we can do that. Reveal. Don't have to reveal because we know what he is. Ooh. How did you get him down there? I couldn't move mine forward last time, it wouldn't let me. Okay, let's move some up. We know what one of his fighters are, that's all. Oh, he's got a fight. <laughs> Okay, we can go to there. He's got a fighter there. That's two fighters there. He's got to be over this side. I'm going to push up. Uh oh, mine. Uh, can we get another fighter in there? We can. That's going to give us a four. <laughs> Trying to push into his back lines. Oh, he's got a six there. He knows I've got a four there. I'm going to need to move Matey across in order to defend against him. Oh, okay. What's that then? So even if it's a five, we've got him. Don't really want to be wasting shit, so we need a three and a three. We've got another fighter coming in that way. That's fine. He can do his 50 moves, and now he's going to do another 50 moves. Let one, two. So we know where a lot of his fighters are. Up this side. I don't really want to reveal him. I can't move past him. Okay, we'll, we'll put him there. As you can see what he is. He's a two. Bring another one. Need to bring him in there. Okay, we know where all his fighters are, we just don't know where his ships are. Let's take this guy out. Oh, they can shoot me. That did work. Okay. That's a four. Let's go in. Uh, no, 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 no. Cancel that. Go in there. Because we can bring him up. Let's take him out. We're doing good. This is strategic. Uh, we'll put the three back there, I think. Can I get that guy? That guy. This guy. Hello? Any of them? Heavy fighters there, yeah. Heavy fighters. Retreat. Out of it. Um. Hmm. We'll move up. He's going to go for him, is he? Okay. And he's going to bring this guy over from the other side of the map. That's not good. Got to be careful because this could be all mines here. I can't go there, so I'm going to bring him over. And I can bring another one over because that will give me a four attack along the back. So he's going to bring another fighter from somewhere. He shouldn't be able to do that because I can't do that. I can't do it. Push up with our fighters. Probably a bad thing to do, but we're getting rid of his forces. He's going to bring another fighter in, so he definitely is over on the right somewhere. It's 
Bring this guy over to there. Um, let's take that guy out. Oh, I can't. I've got to uh, bring all these guys out, I think. We'll do a like for like on this guy. Oh, hang on. Will he not do it? Done. Yeah, we've got to do him first. And then this guy in to support him. Take that guy. We're winning now. We've got some good ships left. Right, that's moving, so we can go kill that. See what he's doing. If it moves, that seven should be able to kill anything on the board. He doesn't know what I've got there. <gasps> oh no! We've got nothing that can take that out. That's a like for like battle kill. I've got a feeling we're going to have mines all around here. Or at least another mine. Yeah, you move away, mate. Take that guy out. Heavy fighters retreat. We need to get some fighters up the front. These guys we know. And we need to test that back line to find where he is. Got a fighter. He's going to bring in another fighter. So there's two. He's got to be that corner one. Well, this guy can take him, definitely. We can get another move of a fighter up to there to back him up for the next turn. You're doing good. I'm hoping you're following my strategic. Yeah, he's starting to think this might not work. He knows this is a fire, but he doesn't know what it is. I'm going to bring him over. So we've got two fighters groups over it. Even though I don't need to. Because then I can reduce the heavy one back. And save him if I need to. We've just got to play test now. Now he doesn't know which of these four ships, or at least three of these, or those two saying that, is my ship. Now this could be a minefield. It is a minefield. I knew it was going to be a minefield. I'd be surprised if that's his. I'm going to go... Oh, can we not? Just move that. Uh, no, actually, I don't want to move him. Just leave him there. Done. Okay. We don't know what this guy is. We're going to move him up. He's going to go like for like. Fair enough. I've still got the, the control of the board. Especially with two sixes there as well. Oh, we actually survived that minefield. Didn't realise that. Select a ship to move. We're going to take his six out. 
His seven could do a lot better. We've got no fighters. He's coming in. We're going to have to go for that corner one quick. Oh, he's going back out. He's panicking. He's panicking. We're setting the board up. We've got the board set now. Yeah, now you know it's not that one. I'm going to tease him a bit. We've got to tease him a bit. Let's see where he's going. He wants to come around and get this five. Look, that's what it is. Let's tease him with that five for a bit. six across we'll test him out I'm gonna I want to annihilate him in the last few minutes I'm surprised that we went an hour with this I want to see what that is I'm gonna take it out it's another six I don't mind he's got one piece moving one of those has got to be a minefield I'm gonna test the four first I think that's his one chip it is his one do we see what his other piece was? No. We've defeated him. We've won the campaign. So, okay, the, summary. This game's worth seven quid on Steam. Okay, in an hour you can beat the campaign. The campaign, though, is really only there, I believe, as a tutorial to get you used to the gameplay. The main hulk of the game is the multiplayer online and I tend not to do multiplayer online games but you guys can um, I could do it I could show you this as multiplayer online at some point it is a board game it's something that we're not used to on my channel so we're throwing it in there just to show you it is out now as I say it's about seven pound on Steam um, it's made by a UK company based up in Bristol um, they are called large visible machine and they sent me this for free now I could say it's shit they're not going to worry. Well, they probably would worry, but I'm not bound into any rules by it. They just said, here's a game. See if you like it. Show it on your YouTube channel if you want to. If not, don't bother. It's, it's entirely up to me what I do with these games when they send me them. There's no, like, I'm not bound into an agreement with this company, is what I'm saying. I can do what I like. I kind of like it because of the fact it's strategi Stratego, which is what I used to play in my childhood. But you really want to play like for like against another human being. And we haven't done that today. And I've done that intentionally just to show you the gameplay mechanics. Not what it's going to be like. You really want to. Let's go back to main menu. You know, back to main menu. That would be main menu. You want to do this. Multiplayer. This is it. Public game. Join game. Create game. This is it. You can create private games. This is where you want to be in here. Now... If there's a couple of you and you like it, then go and grab it and play it. Uh, Skirmish is just random maps. I can pick anybody. I can do standard or full. I could do a full one against this guy. I can start and then you get the whole fleet and you place it. And it's the same over and over again. It is only a board game. Let's go back. I kind of want to go back to the main menu when you do that. Not back to another menu. Um... Don't say main menu, that's a little bit irritating to me. But yeah, see how you get on. Um, public game. Search for an opponent. Du -du -du -du. Here you go. Leonardo. Oh, we've got one. Let's do it. Let's just start it. We're just going to go in. See how it goes quick. We might have to quit out. He might take hours to make a move. It's not hard, Leonardo. You're now famous on YouTube. He is going to take an hour to decide his move, apparently. He could be putting his pieces down. We'll count to ten. Come on, Leonardo. This is your chance to be famous, man. I'm guessing you're an American. Come on. You can be famous, or you can lose. I think he's going to lose. Let's give him a count of ten. Ready? Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, one. 
See, yeah, right, is that an hour mark, mate? You took too long, sorry. And again, not back to main menu. Right, anyway, that's going to be a lot for today. We gave him a chance, he didn't make a move. But if you play online, if you've got a friend, create a private match, go and play them. And I think it'd be a good game just to chill out with, really. They remind me, this ship down here, look, I don't know if you can see my cursor. Battlestar Galactica. That is that is your fighter, right there. I don't know where they got the design styles from. I do like it. It's a nice, tidy little game. Based, as I say, based around Chichigo. Have a look at it yourselves. See what you think. I don't know how many videos are up there. I didn't check on YouTube to see if there was any other videos or how many are up there. But not a bad little game. Whether it's worth seven quid or not, I don't know. I think it's only really worth seven quid if you've got other people, like friends, that you can actually play with and you enjoy this type of game. Otherwise, I think they're going to struggle for their marketplace, I think. But um, all the best to them, really. If you've liked this video, hit the like button. And I do want to see you put some comments down below on your thoughts, because this is a totally different game to what we would normally put on the channel. You know, we're used to city builders, train builders, things like that, where we're creative, being creative all the time. This is more sort of zoned in on the strategic game rather than your creative side of a game so let me know what your thoughts are on this style of game or this game in particular i'll put the links um the usual links of facebook twitter twitch and patreon all in the description of the video guys most importantly though make sure you're subscribed to the channel and make sure you share these videos out that's it for this sunday special till next week it's goodbye from me for now bye bye